welcome to GameDemo.tv's review of Airport Mania First Flight, a demo that can be found at GameDemo.com. And the game comes to us from these fine folks. The game starts out like any other game at the menu screen. You have uh, players, users, options, the options you can adjust the sound levels. Nice little feature is it uh, auto saves when you leave and you can resume the game right from where you left off. The object of the game, aircraft come into the playing field, you have to select a runway for them, and then you have to send them to a gate. You can do this one click at a time, or you can multi-click like right here, and then they will land and go to the gate. Over the right, you see a little balloon there, the object is to keep the balloon on the playing field. Alright, talking about power-ups, there's a color change. Uh, once you get all the colors assigned to the gate, sometimes it's not very convenient, so you want to assign a different color to the aircraft. Change it to yellow here, and I'll send it back to the gate. The advantage of this is that it helps your multiplier, and the multiplier gives you more cash. So that's uh, why you would want to do that. And with more cash, you get more power-ups. Later on in the game, get a whole bunch of power-ups. Just talk about a few here. Get uh, new layover spaces, a VIP layover. Uh, you can add gates. You can improve the gates. This allows your passengers to board and deplane the aircraft more quickly. Add new runways, in-flight movies, beverage service that keeps the people nice and calm. Don't we know it? Sometimes you don't have the funds available, you can sell things and then buy uh, different things. So, you're not totally uh, restricted on buying and then you're stuck with the, whatever you bought. Radar allows you to give you a, a little uh, heads up on what color is coming so you can plan accordingly. VIP runway, able to paint the space like I showed you earlier. You're able to um, blow the fog. You got fog and ice that you got to deal with later on in the game. And the uh, improve the repair station. And then you can also add new aircraft. Larger aircraft. Alright, talking about the repair station, let's visit our hangar. Oh, look at that. It's Eric the AMP mechanic from Indy. No, no, no. You get much more competent aircraft mechanics for uh, you in this game and uh, they hang out in the hangar right there the other power or uh, area that you have access to is the fuel station I wish there was fuel trucks rather than the station but whatever uh, the gates like I said uh, when the aircraft pulls in it changes the color of the gate the more planes you send to the color the better off your multiplier that's how you change right there is the paint station you can change the uh, color of the planes Right here is the holdover pads where the uh, planes can go and sit and they don't get uh, as upset. And then the runways. Uh, best idea is to use one runway for takeoff, one runway for landing. And later in the game you'll get a more advanced radar system. Talking about the pros and the cons. The pros, it's simple. It's addictive. Good for all ages. And that same game feature I mentioned earlier, the cons. It takes a long time to uh, level advance. I wish instead of pumps there was a truck to drive around that would add a new dimension. So to sum it all up, the gameplay is addictive and it is worth the download. You can go to GameDemo.com, search Airport Mania. And this review was by Kevin Carney. I hope you found this video uplifting. Yeah.